Ah. Hello and welcome to the Roman Gazette. This week we are going to be looking at finding Roman roads, our guide to. As I'm sure you will have guessed, there is an acronym and it is SMAS. And the first S in our funky acronym stands for SWELL, SWELL MAN. So here we have a Roman road coming up to a modern day T junction. Now the Roman road didn't stop here, it carried straight on, but it's all been robbed away and lost. All this has gone here. But if you look in, not here, if you look here in the hedge line, you can see the swell. The hedge line has preserved the swell, the agar of the Roman road in there. Swell. M is for milestone, such as this one here at Forton Hall, which is close to the line of the Roman road from Walton the Dale to Lancaster. Lancaster. This one at Fulton Hall is about 200 metres away from the actual line of the Roman road. But when you get the, one of these, it's a pretty good clue there's a Roman road lurking around. So A, of course, is for agar. So for A for agar, we're at Thurnham Roman Catholic Church, and I'm going to invite you to come into the woods with me. So we're sticking with this Wharton Ladale to Lancaster Road and the best preserved section of agar is in these woods. And when you've found an agar or you think you have, one of the best ways to identify it is if you can find a spot like this where it has been cut through by later tracks or work and then you can get the real sense of the proportions of it. Now it can be difficult to identify these aggers on film so I've put the WC21 UK Productions Limited tripod into this gap where someone's cut through, some idiot has cut through the Roman agar in the centuries since and hopefully that gives some sense of the scale of it. So much of this Roman road has disappeared, ploughed out, overlain by modern roads but here in the woods this stretch survives preserving something of its original Roman form. This is the sort of thing that gets me really excited. S is for stones. The second S in SMAS is for stones. So I know this is a little hard for YouTubers with their attention spans, but do you remember that milestone we saw a few moments ago? Well, now we're gonna go and find the actual road. Believe it or not, it actually crosses this farm track, but how would you find it? Now we know from our research that the road should be crossing the lane somewhere along here. How can we find it? Ah, what's this? Stone, 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 stone. So now we've identified the extent of the scatter of our stones. We can use state-of-the-art technology to take a reading. There we go. It's around about four metres. That's about right. We've found our Roman road. So who needs experts when you've got the Roman Gazette? So remember that SMAS. Swell, milestone, agar and stones. So you will have to do a bit of research with maps and YouTube and things like that. Don't trust the Ordnance Survey though. They think they are experts but they are not. I hope you've enjoyed this edition of the Roman Gazette and have learnt loads. Make sure you like, subscribe, click the notifications, leave your comments down below. Now like a lot of successful YouTubers we've now contracted out our editing so the endings for these vlogs moving forward are going to be really slick and smooth like the rest of the production. Until next time stay safe. Thanks for watching. Who cares about learning the Roman numeral system anyway? I, for one,